Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Peyton Forbes. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Thursday, October 14th, 2021. Now it's time to take a brain break. Now let's go to Randy for our Hispanic Heritage segment. Thank you, Peyton. Alfredo Molina is a British-American actor who comes from a Spanish-born father and an Italian-born mother. He has appeared in over 200 films, television, and stage productions, and he first rose to prominence in the West End, in earning a nomination for the Lawrence Oliver Award for Best Newcomer in a Play for his performance in the production of Oklahoma. Alfred is also widely known for playing the role Doc Ock in Spider-Man 2. Now let's go to Scott for the sports highlights. Thanks Randy. Sports fans, this past Tuesday was our last flag football game. Our Patriots played against Brazier Mymonades. Even though we lost, our Patriots didn't go out without a fight with Nicholas Meltro scoring a touchdown and Jaden Lamar getting the extra point for an ending score of 28-7. to Great season, guys. Now let's go to Sonia for the lunch report. Thank you, Scott. Today's lunch is hot dog with potato rounds, hot dog bun, baked beans, orange juice, mustard, ketchup, and your choice of milk. Students, please let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit! Let's go back to Pan. Thank you, Sonia. Patriots, the fall festival is on October 30th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The cost for the entry ticket is $5. It includes access to get candy at all trucks and businesses. I can't wait to see all your amazing costumes. Sports fans, girls basketball tryouts take place today in the gym. The tryouts start at 3.45 p.m. and end at 5 o'clock p.m. Scholars, make sure to check out our Hispanic Heritage Stories, which is on our YouTube channel. You can listen in with some of your favorite Hispanic teachers. Patriots, be sure to visit Mini Donut World through the rest of October. You can order your own gourmet mini donuts. You can mix and match toppings to make your perfect donut. Make sure to mention Renaissance Charter School at Pines in the special instructions. All sales go towards helping our school. Scholars, I love seeing all your favorite teams. Tomorrow you can wear a Hawaiian themed outfit. Make sure to lay off the drugs. Sports fans, on Wednesday, October 27th, there will be a boys basketball and girls soccer interest meeting. It will be held in the gym from 3.45 p.m. to 5 o'clock p.m. The pre to pre-qualify, you will need a minimum of a 2.0 GPA. Your behavior in class needs to be satisfactory. You will need a confirmed ride home. You will also need an official physical done prior to the tryouts. And finally, volleyball players will take team photos today, October 14th, from 3.45 p.m. to 4 p.m. Make sure to bring volleyball knee pads, black socks, and black shoes. Now let's see what the weather is going to be like today with David. Thanks, Peyton. Hey, Patriots. Today's weather is 88 degrees and some clouds. In other weather news, hundreds of sequoia trees are perishing every day due to California wildfires. Their population is decreasing. These trees are known as some of the largest trees in California. And even though they are pretty fire resistant, these fires have been expanding greatly. This could affect us since trees help create oxygen for us, but the numbers dropping is creating less oxygen for us to breathe. Firefighters are using techniques like fireproof foil 
to help save the trees. Now let's go to Vani for our Patriots on the Go segment. Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Patriot on the Go. I'm Vani Sutton, your host. Now let's see what the students think about our new question. What's your dream job? Hi, would you like to get interviewed? Yes. Okay, I have a question. What's your dream job? My dream job is to be a pet. Why? Because I can touch pets. <laughs> oh, nice. All right, let's see our next Patriot. Hi. Hi. Would you like to be interviewed? Yes. I have a question. What's your dream job? My dream job is to be like a caretaker or a nurse. Ooh. Well, why is that? Because it's like, it's kind of fun taking care of people. And it's very much interesting getting to know more people. Now let's see our next Patriot. Hi, do you want to get interviewed? Sure. Okay. Well, we have a question for you. And that is? <laughs> What's your dream job? Um, some kind of entertainer. Okay, and why? I like making, I like making people happy. Oh, okay. Hey, do you want to get interviewed? Yeah. Okay, we have a question. What's your dream job? Um, my dream job would be like to make a professional company and make a lot of money to support families. And why? Because I know like there's certain countries that don't have the money for it, so yeah, I support Oh, that's so nice. Okay, bye. I have a question. What's your dream job? I want to work at Target. Ooh, why is that? It just seems easy. Like, and I'm like, I don't like doing work like that. No. Okay. Hi, do you want to get interviewed? Yes, please. I have a question. What's your dream job? To be a lawyer. And why is that? Because arguing with people is fun. Oh, okay. Sure. All right, come. All right, we have a question. What's your dream job? Uh, to be a librarian. And? To be a surgeon. Oh, why is that? Because books are cool. And? So I can help people. Ooh, both great answers. Bye. Today's answers were very interesting. See you next time. Bye. Wow, that was great. Today's birthday boys and girls are Jason Bernadine, Angelo Joseph, Giovanni Lavelle, Amina Mitchell, Nala Mitchell, and Ayana Powell. Happy birthday. Now let's see what our Hispanic Heritage Ambassadors are doing with our segment, Hispanic Heritage Interviews. Miss Marinsack, she's a third grade math and science teacher, and I would like to know what is your knowledge of Hispanic heritage? What do you know about it? That it's to celebrate. And what are we celebrating? <laughs> Hispanic heritage. Hispanic heritage. <laughs> Don't put me on this interview. <laughs> Bye. Let me eat. I'm hungry. So, what are some of your favorite? What I know that you love music. Right? Do you listen to Latin music at all? No. No. Everything you answer me no. Food. food but no. Food. food. Oh, you like food? Yeah. Do you make Latin food? What's yeah, your favorite of dish to prepare? Your favorite dish to prepare. Um What do I like to cook? Uh tacos. Uh, yeah. Tacos. Tacos are, tacos are good. good. Rice and beans. We eat a lot of rice and beans. Um soups like sancochos or my favorite um and eating out a lot and like well i like cuban food that's my favorite that seems to be popular yeah. here um so have you ever visited any countries where there are people of latin yes i went on a cruise to mexico how was that it was really good what parts of the culture did you experience on that trip uh the food, the liveliness of it. I mean, everybody's dancing and singing and happy, so it was fun. Thank you so much, Ms. Martin Sack. Thank you, Ms. Quadrado and Ms. Kane. That was amazing. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Now for yesterday's trivia winners. Congrats to Ms. Newton, Ms. Borth, Ms. Santori, Ms. Gonzalez, Ms. Velez, 
Miss Barrow, Miss Samuel, Miss Stone, Mr. Albitez, Miss Imdenkwa, Miss Onnelly, Miss Stephanie, Miss Moraz, Miss Cavalita, Miss Carmona, Miss Carter, Miss June, and Miss Martin Sack. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's trivia question, which was, what are the three states of matter? The correct answer is solid, liquid, and gas. Now, teachers and scholars, here is today's trivia question. Which land animal can open its mouth the widest? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Everyone at RPTV will like to wish you all a thoughtful Thursday. And don't forget, this year we are all about fundamentals and forward focus. Have a great day!